Hello and welcome to the Street Crime UK YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Today we look at an A-styled model, influencer and rapper who has been jailed after police found him with a stash of drugs and a phone full of messages about dealing. Keenan Carnes was out of work and living out of his car when police pulled him over and found cocaine in his rucksack. He later told officers he had turned to dealing drugs to make money after losing his job. Swansea Crown Court heard Mr. Keynes, who describes himself as a model, influencer and rapper on the talent website Star Now, has recently landed an apprenticeship as a barber. The court heard that on an intention of police in Britain Ferry was drawn to a seat Ibiza car, the rear number plate was partially obscured. There were four males in the vehicle, including the registered keeper, the driver, Mr. Keynes. Sophie Hill, prosecuting, said the police stopped and searched the car and found the defendant's rucksack inside the bag was a 1.5 gram of cocaine. Mr. Keynes was also in possession of one ecstasy tablet and 220 pounds in cash. A subsequent search of his home address found no other controlled drugs. The court heard an examination of the 23-year-old defendant's iPhone found messages relating to the supply cocaine, ketamine and cannabis. The defendant gave a no comment interview to officers. Mr. Carnes of Park Street, Tebeck, Port Talbot had previously pleaded guilty to possession of cocaine with intent to supply, offering to supply ketamine and possession of MDMA and ecstasy when he appeared in the dock for sentence. The court heard he has a previous conviction as youth for making threats to kill, an incident which had seen him holding a kitchen knife to his mother's throat during a row about her giving him money to buy cannabis, but none of the drugs matters. James Harton for Mr. Keynes said at the time of offending, the defendant had effectively been living rough, sleeping in his car and selling drugs to buy food. He described the drug dealing operation as pathetic and unsophisticated. He said it was clear from a probation report that his client had a shambolic upbringing, had rarely completed a full week in school without missing days and had overcoming uphill struggles all his life. But he said the defendant had taken steps to turn his life around, had secured an apprenticeship as a barber and was described by his grandparents and partner as a kind and decent young man. The barrister asked the court to find Mr. Khan's case an exceptional one and to draw back from imposing term of immediate custody, saying sending him straight to prison would effectively wipe out the gains he has made. Recorder Simon Mills told the defendant the courts took no pleasure in seeing a man his age in the dock facing serious charges. He said it was clear Mr. Keynes had been doing a modest trade in cocaine, a substance he described as an evil one which destroys lives. The recorder accepted there were no green shoots of recovery in the defendant's life, but said the courts had to look at the whole picture and the message had to be understood by people thinking of becoming involved in dealing cocaine that the courts took such offending seriously. Giving the defendant a one third discount for his guilty plea and allowing for a further reduction of four months to reflect the extra difficulties of serving a prison sentence during the current COVID pandemic, the recorder sentenced him to a total of 24 months in prison. Mr. Carnes will serve up to half of that period in custody before being released on license under the UK government's early release scheme to serve the remainder in the community. So what are your thoughts about Keenan Carnes and how he turned to the drugs trade and dealing cocaine to merely survive? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for joining us and until next time, stay safe.